Hello and welcome to Christian Living for Children on Social Media. I am Sister Lourdes of the Daughters of St. Paul. Do you think Jesus will be happy when we help our neighbor? Let us watch this. Therese is waiting for her mother to pick her up after school. She becomes worried. This is the first time her mother has kept her waiting for so long. She is about to cry when a car stops outside the school gate. It is Tita Marie, their neighbor, who comes to pick her up instead. Therese learns later on that her mother is sick and in the hospital. Therese's family thanks Tita Marie for her kindness. Other neighbors, too, try to help in whatever way they can. How does it feel when we help one another? Someone asked Jesus, We are taught to love our neighbor, but who is my neighbor? Jesus replied by telling this story. A man was going down from Jerusalem to Jericho. Some robbers attacked him. They took his clothes and money. They beat him and almost killed him. Then they went off and left him on the road. A Jewish priest passed by, but he was in a hurry. He did not stop to help. A priest helper known as Levite also passed by, but did not help either. But a man that many people did not like came upon the victim. This man was a stranger from Samaria. He was a Samaritan. The Samaritan took pity on the robber's victim and cleaned his wounds. He brought him to an inn and cared for him. The next day, the Samaritan gave the innkeeper some money and asked him to take care of the man. If you spend more than what I have given you, I will repay you when I come back, he told the innkeeper. After Jesus told the story, he asked, Which person became a neighbor to the robber's victim? Someone answered, The one who treated him with compassion, Jesus said to him, Go and do the same. What happened to the man who was traveling from Jerusalem to Jericho? Who helped the robber's victim? What is the lesson you can learn from the story? Jesus teaches us to love one another, especially those in need. Jesus wants us to treat others the way we want to be treated. God will be happy if we love one another as brothers and sisters, and if we use our gifts and the service of others. Children, how in your own little ways can you show your love to others? Since we are all children of a loving God, we are also capable of caring and loving others. Jesus continues to teach us today, just as He also taught His disciples, to be caring and loving persons like Him and like our Father in Heaven. Now let us learn and sing together with this song, The Love of Jesus. Should be seen in action, love and service to the Service to 
Dear Lord, thank you for my eyes. I see how I could help. Thank you for my mouth, kind words I can speak. Thank you for my hands, I can help those in need. Thank you for my strength, your love I can share with others. Thank you, my Jesus, for all the blessings, the gifts, the graces, the wonderful things. I want to praise and love you. I want to have a big heart just like you. Amen. Alright, children. That concludes our lesson for today. I hope you've learned something new. See you again next time. God bless and bye-bye.